Hey guys, Bindi and Chandler here on Bindi's Island here at Australia Zoo with our gorgeous lemur troop. They're so beautiful. I absolutely love our gorgeous lemurs. Some of my favorite memories have been spent with these gorgeous guys. <laughs> They're always so much fun. One of my favorite moments in the world was when dad was visiting Madagascar and got to see these beautiful lemurs in the wild. They are so special and such interesting creatures. Dad saw these guys in the wild and saw how much trouble they were having due to deforestation and the illegal pet trade. So he decided that he wanted to create an amazing breeding program for lemurs right here at Australia Zoo. Yes, it's very important to make sure that this species continues for generations to come because they're beautiful and we love having them on our planet. So check out this awesome footage of dad in the wild of Madagascar with amazing lemurs. They are such characters. This is too male. We might just sit here and have a bit of a sunbake, I think. What do you reckon? A bit of a sunbake? Ah. Uh, very nice. Let's just slide across this way. I'd really like to show you. See, there's a whole troop here now. See the way they cling to their mama's back. Watch out for the sun worshipper behind me here. So you can see the combination of the two species foraging, and it's because this huge ficus, this huge fig tree, is dropping all these fruits. And it makes for great foraging. You guys want some figs? Here you go. Now that Steve spent quite some time behaving like a lemur and foraging in the leaf litter, he seems to have gained their trust and they come closer to him than ever before, even accepting food straight from his hand. The ring-tailed lemurs have got a real matriarchal system. So you can see these two females here with their babies, they call the shots. In fact, this one that's closest to me, she is the matriarch. She is the alpha female. When you're a lemur, scent is everything. And you can see the way they're cruising around the tree, pushing their shoulders into the branch. And look at this one. See how he's using his wrists into the branch? They've got like spurs, scent glands on their shoulders and their wrists. And they'll gouge into the tree, gouging the scent right in. Wah! 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 I've spent so much time with the troop that I'm almost an honorary member. If only I had a striped tail and I could whack it up, they'd know exactly who I was. We're on the move. And away we go. Come on then. I just love that footage. Seeing them in the wild gets you so excited to protect them here at the zoo. Absolutely, and Dad was so passionate about the beautiful lemurs that he got to meet in Madagascar. That passion is definitely contagious because here at Australia Zoo, we think the world of our lemurs. We are sending all of our love from here at Australia Zoo from our entire lemur troop. <laughs> they are very cute and apparently very, very hungry. And, and also our guinea fowl as well. They, yes. they say hi too. <laughs> Thanks, guys.